Hi everybody, that's my body care products that I make and that's my business. And due to the current event going on in the world, very awful, I was directly affected by many sanctions and changes that happened because I'm in Russia. And I want to share with you what happened. But before that, I want to tell you my story of how I started my business and what's behind my business. So I graduated from school nine grades and then I graduated from upper secondary education three years it's lower it's not like university and I was offered a job in the city and the salary was way too low so I couldn't accept it because it was not enough for me to survive so I decided to go back to my parents farm and part-time I was working on my parents farm and in another part I was trying to build a business and for the first two years my business was very very bad you know I almost haven't been making any money off of it not enough to leave and I was trying and trying and looking for another ways to build my business make it stronger sell more but it seemed to me that nothing is working for me and uh, little by little as I was not giving up on the third year my business got a little bit better and I was making enough money to leave and I even had leftovers that I could invest back in my business and grow and I was very happy about it but in the end of the third year my YouTube channel started to grow and I met a lot of wonderful people who supported me I want to take my time to thank all of you because that means so much to me for all your likes comments messages orders I'm just beyond thankful and I notice and remember everything since that time I started to have international orders my business started to grow very fast finally I achieved the level that I always dreamed of but after two months since my YouTube channel started to grow these terrible events happened and many people was affected by that and I'm very sorry that that's going on I'm gonna tell you what happened with my business so the very first thing that happened I was cut off from any international orders just because I can not accept international payments from outside Russia and another thing I lost access to many my favorite apps that I used to grow my business or to educate myself just because I cannot pay for them with my Russian card. And another thing that was very unpleasant, and it happened even before all of that sanctions, is that international shipping was very tricky for me. Even though I ship my packages almost the same way each time, some of them made it true, but some of them was either delayed or rejected by Russian customs or by the customs of the country of destination so I was losing a lot of money on it just because I shipped the second time because I wanted people to get their packages and the second time some of the packages made it through with no problem so I still don't know the secret to it it was very tricky for me the another thing that happened to my business is that Instagram was blocked in Russia even though I still use Instagram and many Russians still use Instagram with VPN without VPN it doesn't work at all it is very very slow and I can assume that many will just stop using Instagram and use something else because it's not convenient to use it anymore and for me I can't even open some of my messages because it's way too slow I can assume that I will lose some people from my Instagram account just because Instagram is no longer convenient to use. As Instagram was blocked in Russia, it is no longer possible for me to promote my products through Instagram. So I was also cut off from my main tool to promote my products. Another thing that I noticed that has occurred is because of all of this bad news that coming on each day, it seems for us that things are only getting worse and worse and nothing is getting better. So it caused depression and very much sadness in people. At least people I talk to here are very, very depressed and sad about the situation. And people don't know what to do in life, how to spend their money. They don't know what to expect. And most of the people here pay all of their attention to that situation. And I can assume that because of that, depression going on in the world and in Russia in particular during this time I was not almost making any sales I noticed a dramatic drop-off 
in my sales. Also, another thing that happened, prices went up in Russia, including my ingredients and materials that I used to produce my products. So I can assume because of that, some people will prefer to use much cheaper body care products instead of mine, because I have to also sell it more expensive now. Now I want to answer the question whether it made me feel upset, depressed. Well, you know, that's true. I was very much affected by all of this going on in the world. Things were not going good for me. It's very sad for me because I was trying to achieve it for so long time. Now nothing is working for me as I would love it to work. But in the same time, I can't say that I'm depressed or upset because my happiness doesn't depend on this. It doesn't depend on the things I have or possess. So I'm not depressed because of it. Now I want to answer the main question. Have the sanctions ruined my business? I won't admit it until I haven't gave up. Because my business is still alive here in me, in my heart. I still have this idea. It still exists in me. And um, I'm just planning to reorganize my business, change the strategy, keep on going. And uh, if you remember, I already mentioned in it in my videos that I have created this channel to inspire you. So you won't hear me complaining on this channel. That's it for today. Um, have a good day and bye. See you next time.